There's not many people in the world I have a personal beef with. I've had some internet beefs back and forth. There's very few people I personally dislike. One of them is True Geordie. He's a very Over the last few weeks, Andrew Tate, Top G himself, who is unapologetic about any topic he approaches, has had a lot to say about True Geordie. Now, the two media entities originally clashed when True Geordie went to this podcast and began blasting Andrew Tate for his so-called misogynistic views and then proceeded to label Andrew Tate's female workers as not nice and immoral women. Now, of course, he used different words. Now, of course, Andrew Tate responded, as you would expect, explaining that some of the female workers are married and or in happy relationships, and his accusations were baseless. Effectively, he was grouping and stereotyping women in general, just because they work for Andrew Tate. Now, fast forward, and both men have attempted to come out the victor, now, Andrew Tate went on a low blow method, reminding the world that True Geordie loves to be dominated by women, and he was just an angry big man. True Geordie then decided to use a slur when regarding Andrew Tate's religion, Islam. Effectively, he was saying that Andrew Tate only chose Islam when the whole world had turned against him, and it was ironic. Now, one mistake True Geordie made was making the unfounded declaration about Islam and a religion as a whole liken it to a word he used, explosion. Now you do the math. Now anyone with half a brain would understand that True Geordie made a colossal error. Of course, Andrew Tate latched onto it, and he offered to fight True Geordie and teach him what it feels like to be handled by a real man. Now since this has happened, True Geordie has been dropped from Gymshark Apparel. Now since then, True Geordie has issued an apology, calling the joke horrendous and saying it was an off-the-cuff moment. Now, is True Geordie the next major mogul to be cancelled? Or do we make an exception for him? Let me know in the comments. Stay safe. Safe.